First, though, Markeith Lloyd's second murder trial enters the next phase. Just hours ago, lawyers presented their opening statements. Lloyd is facing the death penalty for the 2017 murder of Orlando Police Lieutenant Deborah Clayton. This is News 6 at 7 getting results. I'm Lisa Bell. I'm Ginger Gadsden. Thank you for joining us. News 6's Crystal Moyer was in court for opening statements. Both the prosecution and defense making their opening statements today in front of the jury. Even Markeith Lloyd speaking out, telling the judge how displeased he is with his lawyer. He left out an important part of, of the defense. And, and also, you allowed, and I, t I told my lawyer to object, you allowed them to, to talk about a projectile coming out of Saturday body, which has nothing to do with this case, which has nothing to do with this case, and they didn't force to bring that up. I told my lawyer to object, and he didn't. The prosecution starting by showing surveillance footage, recalling the events leading up to the shooting death of Lieutenant Deborah Clayton. The evidence in this case will show, ladies and gentlemen, that those were the last moments of Lieutenant Clayton's life before a second, and in fact, what was the fourth, 40 caliber bullet was fired into her neck and severed her carotid artery. The defense bringing up Lloyd's past, saying he has a history of experiencing racism and negative run-ins with police. Lloyd using the insanity defense for his actions, something New 6 legal analyst Steve Kramer says is a burden for the defense to prove with clear and convincing evidence. This can be a very difficult burden to overcome. And what you're looking at a lot of times is a battle between experts and also how well the 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 two sides can frame these issues. 18 jurors seated in the trial, 12 primary and six alternates. Those jurors will be sequestered during the remainder of the trial. Lloyd is already serving life in prison without parole for killing his pregnant ex-girlfriend in 2016. While on the run, he is accused of shooting and killing Orlando Police Lieutenant Deborah Clayton in 2017. If found guilty, Lloyd could face the death penalty. Sheriff John Mina was in the courtroom during opening statements. He was the Orlando police chief at the time of Clayton's death. It is extremely hard for, for all of us. You know, Deborah um, worked for me when I was a, a captain there in North Patrol, and uh, we all knew and loved her. She did so much in the community. The trial is expected to go on for several weeks. We'll be in the courtroom tomorrow as the trial continues. In Orange County, Crystal Moyer getting results, News 6. News 6 has been following the case against Markeith Lloyd since the beginning. You can find all of our coverage on the manhunt, his arrest, and his conviction for the murder of his ex-girlfriend. It's all on ClickOrlando.com.